I mean, shush, Insane JJ. And a rarity coming up next. We have SP joining me on the mic Yo. here at the commentary desk. What's welcome, up? welcome. I just wanted to watch the match and I figured I'd commentate. That, that's fair, that's fair. All right, so uh, what do we got? Palu against Zelda? Yeah. Okay, this should be interesting. Battle of the waifus. What? <laughs> Someone's got to say it. <laughs> and a solid okay. start here for JJ. Looking pretty even right now. Although, Ooh, the, le the right ledge back. trapping from Brian is pretty good. I'm not. I'm not gonna say shh because that's just weird. <laughs> 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 He's cussing at you a bit, bad. Let's go. But, okay, sweet spot Ooh. lands, but that's on shield back throw. Yeah. Oh, oh, not, not doing enough. It. Cancels his momentum with a jump. Oh! Why not? Why not? Just go for it, apparently. JJ's been going for those up Bs like crazy. Like, he, I've been seeing him do like some crazy edge cancels and stuff. I, I don't even know. It's blowing my mind. Yeah, I think, oh, he's just snapping to ledge, right? I have nothing to worry yeah. about. And oh. explosive light. Yep. And then how about that? You got some fans of the chat. Space giving you some hype. Let's go. Whoa, is that is that space? Yeah, surprisingly enough, he's in the chat. He's, he's not banned yet. He loves he <laughs> loves my commentary. Oh my gosh. Thank you. I appreciate it. Like from the bottom of my heart. Oh, the nares. Sweet spot, right in the head. Lightning kick is just like so powerful. I love it. Oh yeah. I love it when it connects. I think it killed poor uh for Kirin's Pichu at like 40 earlier today, like, oh my god. Yeah, that, that's, that's, that's about right. Oh! That was unfortunate. You hate to see that happen. He went to go forward aggressively, but yeah. he did not realize that he fell off the stage. Yeah. So, he just... And then he got pushed down by the slam. Yeah. But, he brought it back almost seamlessly. Yeah, as soon as he hopped down, he finished him off there with the up air, but... So, you hate that to see it. Using And of course, Nair Nair's. Trains. Ooh. Oh. Okay, up tilt, oh. up air. Can he find another? Nope. Not quite. Where's your jump? Okay, he did have it. Down. JJ's spacing on those lightning kicks is insane. Yeah, he just hovers around my yeah. perfect spacing, waits for you to try and commit, and then tries to make you eat it, but Shush not falling for it yet. Yep. That's some good spacing some as well, good though. good ledge trapping right now. Oh, oh, he caught him! That was actually a sick read. Nicely done there. That was there. an amazing read. Bro, I still have to hear back from from what, from what Waterloo before it's confirmed that I'm going to Western. But, like, maybe. Probably. We'll see. I also have to be able to afford it. That is always critical. Ugh. Where are we going now? We're going to... Shadow Moses. Shadow Moses. <laughs> Hazard on only. And you have to stay. You have to stand there and first to get ganked by the giant mech or whatever. <laughs> and then wh whoever I triggered for calling it a mech. I'm sorry. <laughs> Back to PS2. Yeah, no surprise. Both there. run and shield. I like it. Is this Smash Four running and shield? <laughs> Oh, that's one way to punish it. See, I always think of like the Phantom as like being a doubles partner for Zelda. Because honestly, there there's some crazy oh. things you can do in the lightning kick. Holy crap! He's just getting JJ's all these options. just popping off. I had it. A good little, <laughs> good little We're like ten seconds there. From uh, from Brian right now. Oh. Making that jab last for days. Good parry. Nice parry. I don't know if he was trying to hit Brian or trying to get out of there, but... Yeah, well, it made for a good escape in that case, so... It was tactical. Completely planned. <laughs> He's fishing Both for just these spacing their areas right now. Again, pokes him with the down tilt, but not really able to get much of a follow-up at this percent with it. Back throw for the stage position. 
dash attack again. The ledge trapping from Brian is crazy. Still living after the stage dive Nair. Yeah, JJ knows not to be super aggressive with his up Bs now after that. As you say that, he went forward, but unfortunately <laughs> not going to pay off in his favor. It's just taking him out with that up air. Phantom just says a nope to your auto vertical. Yeah, at this percent, even getting it into the opposite direction, I think a sweet spot aerial could kill from completely across the stage. Oh yeah, I think so. All right, Pharaoh joining us on commentary. Take it away, guys. Yeah, what's up? It's me. I'm back. I did my uh, oh, sorry. amateur bracket stuff. Did you? How'd you do? Uh, oh! Uh, let's see if uh, JJ can make a comeback for this. Yeah. It's two out of three, right? Uh, I played against Hush earlier, and his uh, little Mac messed me up. <laughs> I don't know how he does it. The little Mac is actually scary when you don't... When you, uh, uh, when you don't just just, just grab, him, just grab him and throw him off stage, really. Okay, I tried that. <laughs> it didn't work. He just uh, powered through any of my moves with his forward smash. So many spaced aerials coming out from both of them. A lot of, uh, you gotta be careful not to be too predictable though, because JJ's been getting the parries. Yeah, both Paolo and Zelda are very known for their aerials. Uh, both of them are very powerful, like we have Paolo with their uh, neutral uh, air. It's a very nice move, and uh, her up air can finish off the top air. And back air. Well. Gets punished for going for the up B again. I think JJ may have to calm down a little bit with those. Zelda's up air is very needy, like I mentioned before. Trying to two frame with the down smash, missing it, and getting the forward tilt. Now it's all even up. Let's see if uh, Hush can close up the set here. Down throw. Shielding the Nair. That probably can be very Ooh. impressive with her. Uh, the getting kit. Nair from JJ. But Zelda can Both just playing neutral. Right. Sweet spot for it. Oh, oh, man. This is getting real close between both players here. Oh, and the lightning kick. We'll yeah. Take it. Going to game three of losers finals. Oh, yeah, this is losers. Oh, oh, we got grands wins. after this? Yeah, whoever wins this goes to grands. Against, um. Sid? I think so. Yeah, probably Sid. It's always the grand finals. <laughs> it's always Sid. <laughs> All right, going to Battlefield for Game 3. It was a great place for Palutena to Nair chain. Oh, yeah. Seems like they're in a really good spot. Even, uh, even Zelda can uh, kill off the top real easily in the class. Oh, yeah. And, uh, up there. Neither of these characters, you want to be caught underneath them. Oh, yeah. Both sure. with the insane uppers. As like usual, they're just both spacing their aerials right now, forward airs and back airs. Oh, yeah. Trying to get that first in, hit in to start a combo or a chain. Always going for these up piece. They got a lot, of, like, a lot of end lag on them, which leaves a uh, big open for JJ to be, JJ to be punished. Yep. He's been punished several times already because of it. He has to be careful when doing these up piece. JJ That's being great. really aggressive, just throwing out all the moves. <laughs> you can always keep up with boxes. <laughs> <I> can't hit <laughs> I, I never really understood that that phantom's uh, hurt box. Uh, it's it's a little weird. It, ta it takes revenge stack. Oh, nice. Okay. Because I had a, I had a revenge stack up and I hit the uh, I hit the uh, phantom and, FP, and it yeah. took the revenge stack. Like, what? Yeah, because you hit something, I believe. I, th I think that's how revenge works. Like, if you hit anything, it'll take the revenge away. Oh, dash attack. Still a really, really close game. Surprisingly even between both players. Well, I, I say surprisingly, I mean, uh, I don't mean that right now. Oh. Really Basically, bad. exactly even percent. <laughs> Basically. The advantage is just switching right back and forth between both of them. Yeah, 
off stage there. Not yeah. enough, though. They can gamp some recoveries, but Zelda's is really good. Forward to, oh, down throw to up, up air. air. Uh, needy up air. Let's see if JJ can pull this out and bring it back. This goes on the grand finals, so. I'd like to see this go to last last stock, last hit. I don't know. Maybe. I think, think it'd be exciting. Oh, oh. oh, there we go. We're going on uh, last stock situation. However, JJ does have the deficit for the percentages. Never mind, not anymore. <laughs> Alright. And, uh... Yeah, this is getting real close between both players. It's, uh, it's been like this for all three games, it looks like. Ooh. For the back, back throw. throw. Setting up the Phantom for the edge. Or for the ledge trap, my bad. Yeah, it's very good for ledge trapping as it can cover many options for uh, get ups and recoveries. Oh, trying to two frame with the uh, down tilt, Ooh. but not quite. If that connected, that would have killed. <laughs> oh! Ooh, the up connecting. Alright, the ledge trap with the, the Phantom. Phantom. Okay. Oh, nice patience from us there. Oh, this is getting real close. Extremely close is, uh, call. Yeah, this is a nail biter here. He has to be careful about the upward slash on the phantom there. Back, Back. throw. Gonna go for the edge guard. Yep. Going for the ledge. Good option. Jab. Rapid jab doesn't really won't really do much here. Jay just trying to end it right here. I can uh, I can feel the heat rising in this room. <laughs> Brian's starting to play super safe now. Knows he only needs one more good hit to get uh, JJ off the stage. Both well, players being very patient here, waiting for another to make a mistake. Well, uh, oh. oh! JJ did not realize he wasted his jump. A really unfortunate way to end the set here. Extremely unfortunate. Formidable performances from both players in this set, though. Good job, guys! <laughs>